Makan, 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 makan. Makan, makan, makan. Go to my practice. Okay. Let's continue on my glasses. What is that? What is that? Um. I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you're having a good day. I try to put my other camera on and um, it's giving me issues. So, so there's that. I'm gonna make sure my volume's up. It's not. So, that's been my prayer, guys. My prayer, guys. All right, we're love. We're love. I've got stuff all over my table. All over my table. So, next two weeks. Burgers, raw love. Alrighty. They got a lot to say already. They got a lot to say already. And it's early. Super stiff neck, guys. I don't know. Bad night sleeping or something. So. Got the Empress, the Ten of Feathers. Two of Crystals. Uh, two of Pence, guys, sorry. Um. Page of Pence. And six of wands, five of cups, six of pants, three of crystals, three, that would be, um, three of pants, guys, sorry. And then you have the knight of wands and the love card. So, and the travel at the bottom of the deck with the ace of shells and we're resting right now so let's just let me look at this a minute you guys are definitely taking on the empress energy there's no question there um you feel stabbed in the back. You felt like you were dealing with some type of snake. Really trying to balance out the energies, but in order for you to balance things out, you really feel like you need to stay disciplined and move forward. Okay. Um, you're kind of just at a pause, though. Okay. I think you think something can be very successful, yeah. but something was not successful, obviously. Um, I don't know if there was a third party involved or not. Somebody send me. Oh my god! I mean, you have the three of hats right here. I mean, the three of swords. You're trying to balance on an energy, but I kind of feel like something. Somebody was giving to somebody. There was like no synergy. Okay, somebody was given when you were giving. You were giving to someone else. They were giving to somebody. Yada yada. Um. I think you're dealing with somebody who's in and out, in and out. But now. Now I feel like you're chasing love. So, somebody made a mistake. I don't know if it was you or this other person. It's like moving forward to have a new start, you know? So, it's like what you have right here. But I think there, there was definitely somebody else in the picture. Because you feel stabbed in the back, that is for sure. So, I built this Empress. Three of Wands reversed. Ow! And the High Priest is reversed. So, I think secrets, I, I think secrets came out and you felt stabbed in the back. Um, you're literally trying to figure out if, what you're going to do about this whole thing. Okay. Um. I'm about the Ten of Feathers, which is the Ten of Crystals. All right, so Five of Pentacles reversed. 
be coming out of it. So this happened a little while ago. This, this isn't like a recent, I mean, it could be recent, but see, it's kind of confusing. So I don't know if your energy is somebody else's because you're the three of swords right now. Okay, so if you're still in heartache, the five of pens reversed, it would be upright. It was definitely a third party. Here. Tell me about the two of crystals. Um, you're just trying to stay balanced at the same time you're hurting. See, you're coming out of conflict, too. So this is something that must have went down before. Yeah, see, you laid some weight down. So this is talking past tense, and this hasn't done this in a while. But we're still hung up. See, that's exactly why I said you were at, where you're just kind of like at a standstill waiting. Okay, so now that makes sense why you're just kind of sitting there, because you hung up. So the past must have come back around. Past thoughts, past person. Yeah, see, strength and the six of cups. So it's your past. Somebody doesn't have the strength to either approach you or to move forward. So this is either you not wanting to move forward. Um, sorry, change. And it was like a yelp. No, <laughs> like, not having strength. I don't know what that was all about. Um. Yeah, see the six of acorns. See, feeling successful, but but not. There's a pause. All right, the knight of pence doesn't move. They stop. So it looks like a mutual pause. Tell me about the five of shells. What happened, baby? Ooh, what happened? Five of shells. Five of swords. This is ugly. It, it was a lose-lose. Two people lost here. So I, to me, there was multiple people involved here. I have a feeling that somebody stepped out. Somebody stepped with somebody else. This somebody else had somebody else. I don't know if this person is trying to come back or if your thoughts are just with this person right now. I'm talking like your thoughts are really with this person right now. Tell me about synergy. Um, yeah, the magician, it was tricky shit. Somebody was giving to somebody else. See, yeah, you're healing. And the Mr. Healing with the staff. So here's the thing. You were either dealing with an Aquarian or you have strong Aquarian in your chart. Or to me, this is just healing, coming out of it. But why are we in it again? You know what I mean? Tell me about the three of swords. So like, it's repetitive. You've repeated this cycle with this person before. There's no question. See, this is the the six of wands here. It's not coming up because anyone's victorious this week. This is coming up straight up out of ego. Okay. Um, this offer is going to come back around. It, or it did. Or you're going to. But it's on pause. So I don't know if you're expecting it. If somebody's waiting on an answer, you're waiting you're not giving an answer. There's something. Um, tell me about the, the, the Knight of Wands. This is somebody who obviously in and out, in and out. But here's the deal. I feel like this is, yeah, the Five of Cups. See, looking towards the past. But running away from the past at the same time. Okay? But here's the deal. Going right towards love. Going right towards a new adventure with somebody. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, so there's multiple people in the picture. Tell me about love. So I don't know, it's a lot of energy up on this board right now, okay? Um, Queen of Swords reverse, somebody's not talking to you, major biatch right now. Um, Ace of Wands with the Fool Cups reverse. So this connection is, it's like somebody wants a new start and somebody doesn't. What about the Traveler? The Ace of Cups is right underneath the Moon reverse. See, yeah, no secrets came out, so you were out. Secrets probably came out about the King of Cups, or you're the King of Cups full of emotion. All right, but here we go with that offer coming right back at here. You guys already had that towel moment. Tell me about the Ace of Shells. Ace of Cups, Ace of Cups. Um, so what this is telling me is King of Pentaverse. This particular person is not putting the energy in. All right, and you're dealing with the Emperor. 
in the Hierophant reverse. This person is non-committal. Okay, I don't know who this is you're dealing with. I feel like you're dealing with more than one person. Um, so it's going to be a little tough for my cross watches this week to follow this one. Um, but here's the deal. This is somebody where you feel like you were stabbed in the back. It was definitely a third party. People were sleeping with other people. It was definitely a soulmate. Um, definitely a twin life. It doesn't matter. It was, it was a deep, deep, deep connection and you were hurt. And I think you thought it was going to work a second time around or a third time around or something like that. And it didn't, you, you just keep repeating the same thing with this particular person and you keep getting hurt. So to me, I don't see nobody. I already see walkaways coming back, walkaways coming back. You know what I mean? So it's like back and forth, back and forth. So I don't know what you're going to do, but it looks like somebody is definitely leaving somebody for somebody else. I just don't know which direction it's going to go, okay? Um, who's who's leaving who, who's coming back to who, okay? Because that's the energy. So, um, <laughs> that was a lot. Um... Somebody's definitely left somebody to be with the other person. And I think you were hoping this person was going to come back around, but I don't know how it's going to work for you guys. I don't know who this person or you is choosing. There was just too many energies there. A couple men, a couple women. Okay. We literally had, and this is, could have been a marriage situation because we have the emperor, we have the empress. Okay. We had the queen of wands pop show up um we had the can of cups show up the knight of wands somebody's in and out and out so i can just feel more than three energies guys is this you know so everybody even if somebody's out of the picture the energy is still in the picture hey kaden Kade. Oh, wow. I know, so cool. okay. Any additional messages for my Virgos? Additional messages for my Virgos. Um, but somebody, it looks like somebody's coming back, somebody's leaving, you know, letting go. You have the letting go card. It's like, so the universe is saying, let go. You know, yeah, you may feel like an outsider because chances are you're lonely. All right, the tower definitely came in. Um, they're saying slow down a little bit, like slow, what are you doing, Kai? Slow down, okay? Um, people are projecting, um, images, it's like, hey, Kaden? Yeah, can you actually turn the AC on and shut the slider, please? It's getting warm. People are projecting other things off of other people, okay? So talking to people they shouldn't be talking to, we're getting information. From people you shouldn't be getting information from people aligned to other people okay um whether it's you or this other person but somebody's in a rush to do something and it's like the universe saying slow down you just had a tell moment you had a tell moment for a reason and it, and it wasn't to jump back into the same scenario you know what i mean so um give me that fan i know it's blocking the view um but they're saying let go, you know, let go, let go of this right now, okay, what's meant to be will be, it will come back around if it's meant to be, um, but somebody's definitely leaving something, okay. they're asking you to be a little more receptive when it comes to this, okay. like really, they, there's another eight, they really want you to walk away, see, here's another alone card, we're feeling awfully lonely right here, but I guarantee it's probably a lesson, okay, have the courage to move forward, go towards the sun, and it's going in this direction, but it's going in a different direction. It's not the same direction as anything else. I mean, backwards, okay? So my Virgos just need to move forward. And um, you're losing your mind, I mean, For a long time, you didn't accept the uh, the changes. We have a lot of source cards, transformation. Um Yeah, Katy Perry on Roa. You're about to lose your mind too. But 
my best advice I can give you is just kind of like sit back, let things unfold, because I'm not really sure what the outcome's going to be in this one. To me, the universe is kind of saying, move forward, have this new start, because you have a new love. Okay? Or there's somebody you love more, but you got yourself caught up in a sticky situation. So only you can fix that sticky situation. Okay? It's, that's a tough one. It's a tough one. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, it's like you're with somebody, you know, you obviously have the courage to move forward. Um, be grateful for what it is you have right now. So, and you know what's ironic? This reading is definitely for my Virgos, but I feel like it's actually talking to my cross watchers too, because I really feel like this either was like a marriage or a really, really long relationship that kind of went south. Okay. So what it's trying to say is everything happens for a reason the way it happens, because it just, it wasn't meant to be either right now or it wasn't meant to be in general. So move forward because if you take that new start, you had the Ace of Cups right there with another two of cups. So it, it's, it's self-respect and then going towards something you actually deserve, okay? So lessons for my Virgos. I think that particular message right there was for cross watchers, not necessarily the whole read, okay? And decisive. Like I said, you're just sitting there. You're in hanging in mode wondering, like, what's next? But in all reality, the universe is really saying, just walk away. If you're not happy and people are dipping out on other people, walk away, okay? Like, not a good scenario. And blame. Take responsible. Take responsibility for your own well-being, for your own actions. Okay. Um, trust your inner voice. So obviously, for some, it's PSA, and we don't want to walk away because it's PSA. And we don't have any, you know, evidence that there's cheating. Use your damn intuition. If your gut's telling you something's going on, and it's sketchy, get out. Get out. Okay. They're literally saying, trust your inner voice. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's why you were hung up right there. That's why I felt you like, what are you doing? Because you're sitting and waiting for results. And please don't do that. All right. Success. Know that there's no greater love than success. Here we go with that pride. Okay. I told you there's the pride taking place here and guilt. So people have some guilt and some regret. But for whoever has the guilt and regret, you know, it's part of your lesson, so maybe, you know, you guys dipped out on somebody, and now your pride's getting in the way of moving forward, or speaking the truth, or taking taking blame for something, you know, this is a lesson when it comes to love, too, okay, um, this is somebody who takes the, who probably enjoys challenges, but when the challenges get tough, they don't, they don't face them, they run, okay, and we're just sitting, and waiting for somebody to, to step in, and say something or take action and right now to me it's have self worth step forward and get yourself out of that scenario you know what I mean that's it's not a any good scenario that you're sitting in right now okay um it's just not um you do have something waiting right there but the universe is saying take the risk and it's not the risk like that. Like, take the risk and step out of what you're stepping out of. You don't need complete clarity. You know. You already have an inner knowing what's going on. Okay? So, use your damn intuition and get yourself out of that situation. Please. Best advice for my Virgos regarding that spread, please. Best advice. I still can't find. Oh, there they are. My Virgos, my Virgos. I saw that strong. It's, it's the beginnings, okay? Invincible. Stay out of whatever it is this is going on right now. Just, like, stay out of it. You know, the universe is really stressing that, okay? Like, no need to be involved in that right now. You're not, you're not getting anywhere. So step out of it. Because by sitting there, your soul's not growing nothing, okay? So it's my dear one. I know you've been searching your whole life for a sense of belonging or feeling home or acceptance. Which makes sense because I kept saying, I could tell this was something you've repetitively done, whether it's with this person or somebody else. I feel like it's repetitive with this particular person, too. 
It says, come and enter the house of the night. When you choose a symbol, you have joined us in the community of beauty, friendship, secrets, only shared between the chosen ones. You are chosen to belong. The symbol tells you you're at the right place at the right time. You are at home. Be comfortable with who you are from the inside and out. Be comfortable in your own skin. When you choose this symbol, I, the goddess of Nyx, have chosen you. So basically, everything happens the way it happens for a reason. Okay, this is a no-good scenario, and you have a beautiful, beautiful love and a beautiful connection coming your way, or vice versa, whoever it resonates with, okay? Um, because regardless if you're the, you're the cheater or the victim, or regardless, it was, it went down the way it was supposed to go down, and obviously the one that was cheating has the harsher lessons, but, um, regardless, once they learn, you know, there's, there's so much better out there for not just one or the other, but for both, okay? Um, it's learning. It's forgiving. It's it's moving on without having, you know, some people don't have the proof and they're not moving forward and the universe is saying, don't, don't do that. Your intuition's already telling you. Your intuition has been telling you that something's been going on and you chose to ignore it, okay? Um, and I think there's other people talking about other people and stuff being said and, and shared and swapped. Take your power back, okay? Um, use your God-given power and intention to manifest blessings into your life, okay? So it, it's like the scenario you're in right now it is definitely no good. It's almost like they're yelling at you, like, use your God-given powers and intentions and manifest, you know what I mean? Like, let's go, like, take your damn power back type thing. It says your material needs are provided for you when you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams, okay? So this is big on manifestation right now. This is big on getting yourself out of a certain scenario making your own money, feeling independent, stepping forward, okay? Um, I didn't see codependency. I didn't see issues like that. But with these cards up here, it is an issue. Maybe some people don't feel like they can, can move forward because of somebody else paying the bills or whatever the case may be. But as soon as you move forward into different energy and you step into your own, here comes peace, okay? Remembering that love is real, okay? Like, it does exist. You're just with somebody who doesn't know how to give it or vice versa. But kind of felt that too. Career transition, your life's being triggered, okay, by a blessed career change. So you're probably, you're worried about money right now, where you're going to go. We're just saying breathe, take several, several deep breaths, slow down and weaken your energy to release old patterns. So you're either thinking about a new job or you're about to get a new job offer or you're just not happy where you're at, okay? They're saying just leave. And I know it's easier said than done, but they got you, okay? Um, but be practical. Don't just listen to Courtney and be like, Court said I can quit my job and I'm going to be fine. And like, don't be unrealistic, all right? Like, the right approaches still need to be taken. You just had Taylor Swift, too. Like, shake it off. Like, you have all these songs saying, just, you know, push push forward. Like, you can do this. You just have to push, okay? Um, but you need to take control of your life back, your scenario. Be an individual, all right? You're not happy at work? Find a different job. All right, if stuff's going down at work, you know, seek, seek another job while you keep the other one. But I'm telling you, right now they're putting you on your purpose. And they're really pushing you to take this new journey, an individual journey. And then here comes a new love, okay, for this, for those who that resonates with, okay? So be big and brave and step forward, okay? Everything's going to be okay. Big breaths one day at a time, okay? Um, that's for sure. So, real quick, any additional messages for my Virgos. And don't feel like you're giving up on somebody. Don't feel like you're gonna leave somebody in the cold. It, it's the way. It's not that you, you're intentionally wanting to do that or vice versa. These are the ones that, obviously, my Virgos, I have a heart, you know. Here we go with the chariot. Move forward. Don't look. You're looking at the past, but move forward, all right? Like, this is obviously somebody you've been with for a long time. So it's basically just commitment. You basically know the truth right here with the Ace of Swords. Like, even if you don't, step, step into your own damn truth. Stop looking backwards type thing, okay? With the Three of Wands, yeah, see, I don't need to go any further. You know, go, you're going to balance yourself out. But, um exactly what it's saying okay but I think some of you are going to feel like you're giving up on this person but you know what you're not happy you're not happy speak the truth speak from your heart speak from your soul 
like it's just not working anymore we got a lot of love you know we have a lot of memories xyz but it's time to to set each other free you know people get so stuck on certain scenarios that you know you literally forget who you are sometimes okay um and i know that from this song right here okay and it's like, say something, because somebody's not saying something, but it's also the name of the song, say something, but it's also the album of the great big world, let's say, Christina Aguilera, okay? So I know some of you, it's going to be really hard to walk away from this, but it's the right thing, and you know what it is. And the only reason why you're staying around is is comfort, because we don't know how to self-comfort yet, you know what I mean? But it's okay, be an individual, please step forward, okay? I love you guys, have a fantastic week.